Welcome back, guys, to Friends Who Eat Each Other. My name is Gay. And I'm Z. Welcome back to Scarlet Nexus Part, part 10. 10. And with the last part, we kind of had the whole reveal with uh, Naomi. Na- Naomi. God, it's again, it's been a while. So I'm trying to remember everyone's name. So it's sorry for if I'm stuttering. Okay. Um, random we just, update. Yeah. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> that was just random. Yeah. And. Actually, I noticed in the last part, I kind of forgot to give um, uh, Sheedon his, one of his gift, like the one that we had from the previous before we started the previous mission. So yeah, I think we should just start with the gifts first for once instead of doing what we always been doing. I can never do what she's doing right now because I will fall flat on my face. Do I not have any gifts? Oh. Uh, you you strike me for saying that. I thought we did have some gifts. Uh, yeah, I f- I, this is the thing I forgot to give him. Is there? I thought we had, there was more. I thought we had some for Kyoka. Hmm. Looks like we don't. Oh. Let's get one oh. thing straight. You're not the one leading this platoon. Okay. If anything, I'm letting you lead us. Don't forget that. <laughs> so it sounds like I am the one leading the platoon. I'm just saying, don't be smug. Don't let it go to your head. Hey, finally a bond level up. What's this one? Oh, the combo vision now. And increase of the SAS gauge. That would be useful. Oh, hey. A cork board. I feel like I've learned a little more. About I don't you see it. Those. Where is it? However annoying that may be. I don't know what you mean by annoying, but it's good that we understand. I each do other like Archie's little area a little better than everyone else's. Mm. Sure. Man, why do they make it like that? It's hard to see what the pictures are. I know. I know. I'm gonna check. Did we? Was there really none? I'm gonna yes. check again. Well, are you sure? Okay. Gifts. Uh, here's that. I guess, yeah, I guess there I, there was none. Huh. We'll do that after we give everyone. And apparently I didn't have one for him either. Okay. I guess we're starting the bond. Ep- oh. oh, Kasane, perfect. Can you get me a soda from the refrigerator? Sure. But I think it would be faster if you got it yourself. Yeah, especially you. I need my calories. Burning those calories with my power would be putting the cart before the horse. I guess. Don't worry, I'll pay you back. I don't know when, though. <laughs> what? Hey, increase the bottom. I want my money back now. <laughs> yeah, especially this will be useful for her, the recovery. Because we burn yeah. through hers so I think damn understanding fast. you better will make our battles more efficient. Well, then I guess we both need to understand each other. Okay, was there any gifts for her? Oh, yep, tool set. You have a good eye. Thank you very much, Sharshi. Oh, hey, team bond level is level two now. Sweet. Uh, I think that's over, it's usually over here, I think it was, or... Oh, hey, there it is. Cool. Now we see that. Now let's get on with the mission. Or, wait. Do I... Oh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> St. Ron City. First time we're doing anything in here, because those of you who have seen our per- first arc, we never ever went here ever. for the story. We never like, we ever went, we, we did ever... go here at one point, but that was just mostly explore. Yeah. It looks like Kyoto, Japan, almost, doesn't it? Or Chinese, let's say it's one of those two. Alright, those of you can read that for later. Let's... 
We should treat ourselves to a day on the town to raise spirits. Yeah. We can't force it on Kasane, though. You're right. There we go. To the there right. We. Seeing Naomi like that? Even I was shaken. Stand by, huh? So, what do you want to do? We could go back to OSF headquarters. Before you do, could I have a moment of your time? Mm -hmm. Excuse me, but who are you? Please excuse my manners. I work for the Ceyron government. I have come to ask you all a favor. This is a request from a group of us who do not quite see eye to eye with Travers. What are you talking mm -hmm. about? I thought Major General Karin and the Seiron government are in this together. We have determined that Yuito Sumeragi is connected to the Kunad Gate's formation. Uh, so there's Our some experts people that say know. that the gate will bring a great disaster to the world if left alone. We propose the assassination of Yuito Sumeragi to Travers, but he has skirted the issue. After some reconsideration, we decided that we should delegate this task to the hero who assassinated Chairman Sumeragi instead. You want Kasane to assassinate Yuito? I'll do it. Oh! What? Are you serious? Do you know what you're even saying? Thank you for your cooperation. We have intel that Yuito Sumeragi is currently in Kikuchiba on assignment. I will leave the rest to you. Good day. I wasn't able to find out the identity of that man, but I was at least able to determine that he works for Seiron's Prime Minister. So the fact that this is a request from the government checks out. Are you really going to assassinate Yuito? Look, I know what this sounds like coming from me, but don't you think that's a bit much? I'm not saying what future Yuito told you isn't true. Kakuro does have a point. As of now, we only have circumstantial evidence. Nothing is really concrete. This also goes against Major General Karin's wishes. Are you still going to go through with it? Yes. I'm going to kill Yuito. That's most likely the only solution we have. Only solution my ass? I'll make my way to Kikuchiba. You know what's bad when I'm actually you can't just agreeing leave. with Shiden? That's yeah, Shiden is very smart for somehow. Well, he... No, it's just a case of, it's just really... Even Please he wait, thinks Kisane. You should reconsider! That's right, you're making a rash decision. Oh dear, she isn't listening at all. Damn, she's so selfish. Yeah, it just shows you, even she didn't think this is a little much. He hates Yuito, but he doesn't want him dead, obviously. Um, I think you have to fast travel. I know, I just I saw an item. Where? Okay, guys, I'm looking at this from the left side of my guy's uh, TV. And so I can't it's a little bit Yeah, and we are filled out. Mid-level shopping this district. Oh, I know where he, uh... I know where this is going to take Yuito place. Yuito is, yeah. This is gonna be fun. Oh. I know where Yuito is, um, but... Um, I'll be right back. Kasane, do you really want to do this? It doesn't matter what I want. This is all I've got. Give me the directions. Understood. Using the Shida. For you, Kasane. <laughs> If your body catches fire, it's gonna keep hurting you. Be careful. <laughs> the enemy is done. Yeah. Now's the time. Creating a giant myth. Yeah, he almost pulled out. Oh. That's what I heard in the background news noise to take care of. So Thank I'm back. <laughs> I'm back, so you're welcome. Okay, your power. Yeah, I love 
Oh, that was a backstep. Nice job. I wonder what the. I wonder if you can be winged of. Uh, what's his name? The enemy is well, done and can't move. We will never see what's going on. I want to see, uh, what's her name? God, I can't remember. Pyrokinesis. Uh, what Pyrokinesis does. Yeah, wait, I'm trying to remember, um. Go ahead and use my power, Kasane. With that oil, it'll be hard to move if they get by you, so be careful. Yeah, Nagi's power. I wonder what Nagi's power is. I wonder what It's over. Maybe super speed of power. Well, that would actually be. Well, that's more of hyper velocity. Yeah, that's what I was just about to say. Okay, we got three of these bad boys. I'm using it. Fighting style more than Yuito's. Yuito was nice, in my opinion. Yeah, it just it didn't really fit with me. That's all. Yeah, it's for not me, that um, I hate it. It's just this yeah. case of you're more of a I medium to long range. One. Yeah, medium to long range attack. Me, I'm more of a close That's range. That's how fighter. I am for all games. If you, yeah. any of you don't know, I'm my <clears> favorite <throat> weapon is the sniper rifle, hands down. Mine Battle is a rifle. assault rifle with um charging at my foes and killing them. I'm basically That's a more tank. Of just like mid to close range. Really. Yeah, that's me, basically me. Here we are. Well, we came here just like the guy wanted us to. Are you sure about this? Are you really going to kill Yuito? Either way, we couldn't just let you go by yourself. Everyone here has your back. Listen, Kasane. We'll help you fight, but it ends there. After that, each of us will act independently. Got it? There you are. Kasane? Just hold on! We can talk this over! No point. You'll be dead. Okay, this Here's is the reverse. first group on group battle. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Why are you trying to kill oh, me? Oh, whoa! She's, she's At least using, tell me the reason. She's using SAS. Can you handle I it? told you I don't want to talk. For you, Kasane. You need to take out one of them at a time before you go. Yeah, I need to take out Luca. Yeah. This is coming from. More power. This teleportation. That's, that's nothing. Huh? That's... Yeah. I thought you were going after Luca. I don't know where Luca is. Where is he? No, we don't have time. You already... If you're training through Yubi-chan, Everything to stop you. Can you just want to stay out of this? Fine. Will you please calm down, Tsukumi? That's probably the easiest one to take down. She doesn't have very good Sorry, if this keeps up, neither of you will come out unhurt. There's Luka. Do you really want to there kill Yuito? You don't have to help me if you don't want to. Just stay out of my way. They're making good. Ah, oh. uh, damn it, hit me. You got to try Kasane, we should attack them anyway. We should nullify 
Find me other two before you meet them. Please, Joker. Done. You want to use that water? There it goes. I know Badger Bully is pretty funny. Well, he's not actually that young. Physically, I know. Ow. I'm using it. Let's Water. Ow. That was a close one. Why is he not using his brain to help you? Well, that's when he gets to a certain health. Oh. That didn't work. Gotta leave the rest. Oh, there he is. Nope. Oh. I'm kind of rusty in this thing. Ah, damn it. We can't give up. Sorry. Oh, great. Here we go, Brainfield. No, he's in. Oh, yeah, wait, no, his brain died. Here we go. Here we go. Round two. Well, actually, round three of this for you. Here we go. For saying that, I forgot what that was. I was pressing the right button. Yeah, I was about to say, have you uh, forgot if this is weird? I actually played through the switch. And so the buttons are a bit different. Yeah, I agree. Bad. Now here's brain field. Yeah, brain field. Oh yeah. Now brain field. Now brain field. Here we go. Now. Although there is a perfect way to hide. Good. Just like this. You turn invisible and Watch let that timer go down. Yuito has the upper hand right, here. I'll just wait for the timer to run. Down. This is kind of cheating in a way. <laughs> if I feel like, you know. I feel like you're cheating a little bit. Yeah. Ow. Okay, ow, that hurts. Although there's also another way to... Sorry. Go! I'll support you. Ow. Sorry. I'm still fighting. There's a weakened member. We can't give up. Thanks. You saved me. Two, one. Done. You didn't enter brain field yourself. And the kill is kind of already on the way. Let's do this, bro. Stop! This should. Come on! Here we tell Round two of this. Round four, Oh, come on! Someone that said they weren't going to help him. Yeah, that's true. Why? <clears throat> Helped quite a bit. Kasane, tell me, why did you kill my father and join Seiron? <clears throat> Is it because my father was involved in metamorphosis research? Because new Himuka turned Naomi into an other? So you found out about it too. Yes, that's exactly right. Master Yuito, Kodama is here! Uh, we never have fought with Kodama. Kodama. Great, just what we needed. We should fall back to our hideout. Uh, wait, Kasane! We've never fought with Kodama, so I don't know. Well, we technically have in this route once. 
This is completely messed up. How can you just decide to kill Yuito God, like that? that's weird. I'm <laughs> that day we came back from the future, you said that it wasn't going to be an easy decision yourself. Our future depends on it. Look, if that's your argument, do you actually have proof that it's all true? I'm sorry, but I just don't believe that killing Yuito is the answer to solving everything. Besides, it seems pretty extreme to kill both the father and the son. What exactly is your reasoning behind all this? If you can justify killing Yuito, then I'm all ears. There's no point trying to explain. That's for us to decide! What? I've been wanting to tell you this for a while now, Kasane, but you are way too selfish! God, it's weird to make quick decisions with and him. determine what needs to be done. Even when you lose your cool, you're able to compose yourself. I really respect those qualities. Yeah, I said it. I respect you. That's why I was able to accept you as my leader. You see the shock no, on her face? Not this time. <laughs> That's the <this is> shock <laughs> on her face. Right now, Don't expect any right now. help from me until you can give me a good, valid reason. That... but... Whoa Shocked there, Sheedin. Everywhere. I think that's enough. Ah, oh, the youth are so passionate. I like it. It looks like your passion got to her. Continuing to harp on her like that isn't going to get us answers. Listen, Kasane. We have no idea what kind of things you're bottling up inside. We don't know the weight of it, or whether it's painful or not. The only thing we know right now is simply what happened to Naomi. Saying that an explanation would be pointless means you have something you should say. Lucky for you, there are four open-minded people here ready to listen. I'm pretty sure there are different perspectives you can consider as well. Tell us. We deserve to hear it. Yes, we're all on the same team here. I'm sorry. So you're really not gonna tell us? N no I just wasn't sure how to explain it, so I'm sorry I said it'd be pointless to tell you. Well, if that was the case, then you should have said something. I I'm sorry. Oh, this apology is for making you jump to conclusions, so... Yeah, I think I got that. Hey, Sheedan, come on. Let's try to relax a little, okay? It's great you're invested, and that's cool and all, but it's also lame at the same time. Shut up! Anyway, if you're gonna tell us, then tell us already. Uh, okay. The first reason is what I felt at Kunod Gate. I felt something like the power of the red strings coming from it. The time portal that should be disappearing lingers because of Yuito's power. That's what made me believe what future Yuito said. The second reason is because of what Karin said. He knows that we went to the future. He does? Arashi, you were eavesdropping so you can confirm. Yeah. From what was said in the future, I knew there was a good chance that Karin was involved in some way or another. He's at least aware that a time-traveling power exists and has accepted it. The third reason is that the Seiron official said Yuito was involved. I see. So for you, all your suspicions leading up to now were confirmed. Yes. I mean, they're all just circumstantial, but it's all I have. I'm sorry. You're apologizing for the wrong thing again. What we wanted was a fair explanation, and you provided one. You don't need to apologize for that. And it's thanks to your explanation, we came to understand exactly why you made your decision. Yeah, I can see where you're coming from now, but I still have a question. Why didn't you discuss all this with us? I told you. I didn't have any definite proof, and I didn't think you'd believe me. But I did. And everyone else here, too. Some of it I'm still not convinced about, but I don't think all of it's a lie. It's proof that your way of thinking is wrong. That's why we should talk from now on. We have each other's backs here. That's what makes us a team. I'm sorry. There you go again. Huh? There's a different phrase you should be saying right now. That's right. If you want to build trustful relationships, an apology isn't what's needed right now. Oh. Um. Thank you. Everyone. 
Tomorrow I, must be a fucking apocalypse because I was agreeing with everything she didn't said. That exactly. felt so uh, weird. I had a shock face. It might be good to talk to Arashi. Kasane, good. Do you mind if I butt in? Haruka, you were listening? Yeah, I agree with everyone. So I want you to know you can always talk to me. When Yuto um speaks, he speaks with no old, uh, no bottling up. He talks about the same thing. Friends, I've never wanted friends before, but there's a limit to what I can do or think of by myself. I'll try to rely on other people a little more. Kasane is more of a she. Yeah, I. No new product. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> she's not very open. She's yes. very. And what she didn't said almost punched me in the gut real quick, like a how reasonable this motherfucker became. <laughs> yeah. I was like, she didn't. You actually make sense. Uh, for a second, I thought there was a an apocalypse. That... Something might be happening to the world or something. <laughs> I literally. <laughs> oh my god, that was so sort of fucked up. I thought like she didn't. It's like I'm actually agreeing with everything she didn't said. That was so weird. Ah, uh, fun times, fun times around. So we failed the job that Seiron official gave us. It was Kodama's fault. We couldn't help it. I never thought failing a mission would relieve me so much. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Again, that is, yeah, of even he's saying, like, he was glad he failed a mission. Yeah. Alright, let's go, let's give these presents now and start the next mission, shall we? Yeah, let's start a bonnie mint this time. Oh yeah, we got the Bond episodes, don't we? Mm -hmm. Arashi, why are you sleeping here? Didn't you say you were going to check the SAS? Arashi is currently in maintenance. Please wait until services resume. Skipping out on work? Arashi, you bring lazy to a whole new level. Shut up! People need to get plenty of rest or they can't work. Plenty of rest? Oh, look at the time. It's almost time to eat. No wonder I'm so hungry. What a stupid alert system. Wow, so you can't even be bothered feeling hungry? Well, I was going out to eat. If you're hungry, then how about joining me? Eat out? Listen, rookie, the city is full of danger. You could find yourself surrounded by civilians or hounded by the crows. Fans in the press. Must be tough being famous. Basically, you're saying... It's a pain. I thought so. We don't need to go out. We have our rations. It gives us the minimum essential nutrients we need. Isn't that wonderful? You care about efficiency that much? Of course. And these rations can be eaten right away. It's my treat. Want to join me? It seems like you're absolutely against going outdoors. Okay, let's eat here then. Ah, this soda hits the spot. There is no better beverage in the world. Glad to hear it. By the way, do these rations taste a little too salty to you? You think so? I'd understand if it were heavily seasoned, but I'm just getting a strong taste of salt. It's not very balanced. Hmm, that's surprising. I thought you were more like me and didn't really care about taste that much. Hmm, now that you mention it, I don't think I used to care. I bet it's because of Naomi's cooking. My taste probably changed without me noticing. She likes to cook too? Handmade hair clip, homemade cooking. She sounds like quite the homemaker. She liked doing it since we were little. And I always helped with the taste testing. I see. That's why these rations are not to your liking. It's not that I don't like them. I just said it's not very balanced. It could just be that my palate is more refined now than it was before. Good grief. Are you really bragging to me about your sister right now? <laughs> How are you two so close when you're not even related by blood? Because my sister was so kind. There's no way I would have survived in that house without her. Did something happen with your family? I guess. Don't get me wrong. I'm very grateful they took me in. But my parents don't see me as family. Not Naomi, though. She's always been there for me. Protecting me. And that's why I wanted to do everything in my power to protect her no matter what. I don't know Naomi that well. We only got to fight together a short time. And this might come off as rude, but that hair clip and Naomi's cooking you hold so dear, I just don't understand their worth. 
However, hearing you tell me about them has helped me to get to know Naomi. You really found yourself a good sister. Yes, I did. Thank you for the food. Okay, we've gone through the chore of eating. Time to resume services. Seems like you're ready to go back to work. Before I forget, you can pay me back for the rations by helping me out with a little job later. What? Oh, just hearing you talk about Naomi, I sense that you're someone who has a strong sense of duty. When someone protects you, you protect them back. In other words, since I treated you to a meal today, you'd want to pay me back. Or else it wouldn't sit right with you. I'm really just doing it for your sake. I'll let you know what you have to do later. Now, I've gotta go. Oh, that's so unfair. Arashi! This must be what she had in mind the whole time when she said she'd treat me. She really got me. Nobody is better at slacking off than she is. You have some potential, Kasane. I could be your instructor if you want. I can teach you the fundamentals of Arashi-style slacking off. Wouldn't you just slack off and not teach me anything? Hmm. I have nothing more to <laughs> teach you. <laughs> well done. Prick. Hey, you three. fucking fast prick. Combo vision. She's a fast little prick, isn't she? Got castle card play um card castle playing cards. Ugh. I never get bored watching you. I'm developing a greater personal interest in you. I don't know what made you think that, but is deepening our understanding of each other a good thing? Alright, let's start the bonding episode with uh Kagoro. Mm -hmm. Kasane, you've come to see me. Let me guess. You finally fallen for this sly fox. Motherfucker! Charms. I'll punch you the gut. Disturbing things do tend to stand out. Ouch! I demand an apology and compensation. Therefore, I'd like you to come to Kikuchiba with me. Kikuchiba? What are we going to do at a ruin overrun by others? I mean, if I suggest we go to Musubi's for a talk, you just turn me down. It doesn't matter where we do it. I hate meaningless conversations. Just think about it. If there are others, we can fight. It wouldn't be meaningless if we were also gaining valuable fighting experience. He's not wrong. If you don't want to talk, you can just focus on the fighting. That way, there's no wasted time. I can't imagine I can improve my skills training with you. Our power disparity is too great. Seriously? Come on, just humor me, would you? Please, Kasane? Why does he want me to go with him? As irritating as this is, this might be a good opportunity to finally get him to tell me about his past. Okay, if it's training, then I'll go with you. That's the spirit. Don't let my graceful knife skills make you fall in love with me. Since I'm absolutely not interested, could you fight invisible the entire time? <laughs> God, she is cold, and I love it. Well, she doesn't trust... There's no Kagura sign of any far others. As she can throw him. What, really? They're usually everywhere. Of all the days they're not around. This is no different than talking at the hideout. Let's go back. Wait, wait, wait! We'd be wasting a trip if we just turned around and went home. <sighs> Fine. Atta girl. Don't worry, I won't bore you. There's also something I wanted to show you. What? It's a surprise for later. Come on, this way. Well, our plans may have gone awry. But at least we can have some fun without getting interrupted by others. Our goal was combat training. Having them around was the whole point. Even you must have realized that the combat training was nothing more than an excuse. Oh, this really brings back memories. This area used to be a shopping district. I always came here with friends to blow off steam. Now it's nothing but a bunch of sad rubble. It gives me a strange feeling. I mean... I guess to someone young who wasn't around back then, this would look like nothing but a pile of rubble. Somewhere nobody lives anymore. Nothing left but visions. It's almost like the entire city has been left to haunt this area. I know it sounds absurd, but in a way, it's actually pretty funny. He's doing it again. He's lost his levity. I wasn't just imagining it. Levity? Is that his sprightness? Uh, Oh, there it is. An arcade game? Not just any arcade game. 
you operate a crane to grab a prize, and if you manage to drop it down the hole, you get to keep it. This used to be real popular back in the day, especially with couples. This is why we came here. Let's see if it still works. It's plugged in, but it's not responding. Maybe it's broken. Wait. No, it's just locked. All right, time to use the hacking program I borrowed from Arashi. That sounds illegal. This place may be in ruins, but are we allowed to just operate this and take its prize? Don't worry about it. It's been left like this forever, so nobody's going to get mad if we take a prize or two. Is that wrong? That's true. Oh, nice, it worked. Ha, <laughs> look at that. Now tell me which one you want. I'll grab it for you. There are only plushies. I don't really want any of them, but if I had to choose one, then that one, I guess. Okay, say no more. Consider it yours. I used to play these games all the time back in the day. I'm basically an expert He's gonna now. suck at it. Start it up, turn here, and now! He dropped it. Uh, I'm not giving up yet. 25 minutes later, he gets nothing. One more time. This time I'll get it for sure. <laughs> he hasn't even gotten a single one yet. At the rate this is going, I'll never be able to ask him about himself. Can I get a turn? If she wins it on the first try, okay, I will be... Okay, but this is more yeah, difficult than I thought it would try. be. You know, I bet the store manager put the prize in a position where it's hard to get. <laughs> she just uses her powers. <laughs> <laughs> you cheat. Hey, you're cheating. All my hard work vanished like tears in the rain. You brute forced a locked machine with a hacking tool. So who's the real cheater here? Oh. Again, she's not wrong. <laughs> Well, I suppose you're right. Okay, then. I know this just started to feel like a date, but I think it's time we call it a day. I actually thought we were going to have to fight our way in the area. Mm. The area. Oh, were you two together? Oh, boy. Looks like we're caught. Well, cat's out of the bag. I guess there's no sense in hiding our secret now. Secret? What were you doing? He thinks we were on a date, which I in no way wanted any part of. If it were a date, well, I'd call it a complete failure. Kasane! Ow. Why would you say that in front of me? What part of it was a failure? Naomi told me dates were supposed to be fun. That wasn't fun at all. Oh, that's too bad. Well, you're a little too young to go on a real date anyways. And I am an old geezer. In fact, I'm old enough to have a kid your age. Now that I think about it, the major here would be more suitable for me. Then why don't you treat it like an outing with your daughter? What's the fun in that? It's not like I actually want to go on a date with him. I can't imagine it'd be more fun than this last one. Whoa now, that sounds like a challenge to me. Okay, give me another shot. <sighs> Do whatever you want. I'm glad you two are getting along so well. Her easygoingness is just... I don't know how to feel about it. Oh, there's two. Oh, hey. Explain yourself. <laughs> okay, I was just reading the message real quick. This is, I remember this conversation, uh, how this ends. Exactly. She... Yeah, she ends up blocking him. There. This doesn't solve everything, but at least he won't ask me about it. He's someone I may have to kill eventually. I need to make sure we interact as seldom as possible. Or else I might lose my nerve when the time comes. <sighs> He's kind of strange. He's not like Naomi or Captain Seto. It's not like I found him especially interesting, so why couldn't I just ignore him? Oh well, he can't contact me anymore. For now, I just need to focus on Naomi. And done. That was real quick. <laughs> and... Oh, with... Gemma. Gemma's a cool guy, in my opinion. Yeah.
Yukasane. Gemma, did you read my message? I came to talk to you. It seems like you still feel responsible for what happened to Naomi. It isn't your fault she turned into another. There's no point in you blaming yourself. You came all this way just to say that? Well, you felt guilty enough to come all the way here. <sighs> You're right. It's probably presumptuous of me to think it was all my fault. Still, I can't forget what happened to her. It's sad to think this is how I behave after the decades I've fought. I don't think it's sad, just surprising. I thought your experience would allow you to cope better than this. That's what I thought. You don't have time to falter when a friend dies in battle. Our role as members of the OSF is to bottle up our feelings no matter what happens, and fight until the last other is killed. But you haven't been able to control your emotions. Do you have any idea why? I must be at my limit. I've lost too many friends. Friends of many years and rookies like Naomi. While everyone else lost their lives, I'm left standing here, my retirement drawing closer. You make it sound like it's bad that you're alive. I feel guilty. The young people with promising futures die, while someone like me with yeah, not many years guilty. left is allowed to live. That's why I was so what? committed to protecting the young members. Guilt is? Yeah, I know that. I know that you wanted to protect Naomi. However, there's no point in regretting the past that way. You're better off focusing on what needs to be done right here and now. I know that. Oh. Gamma, behind you! <laughs> Hell yeah! Good reaction. The enemy was just weak. I can still fight for now. What do you mean, for now? I'm old. I'll have to retire soon. When I retire, they'll stop administering the anti-aging drug. My body will begin to grow old and my power will gradually diminish. As someone who's had to rely on my power for decades to survive in battle, I'm a little worried about its strength diminishing. I do remember reading something about that. It might be the distant future for you, but it's just around the corner for me. Many retired soldiers have a hard time adjusting to civilian life after being in the OSF for so long. There are those who have nowhere else to go after society throws them out. No family or friends to rely on. Are you saying you'll be one of them? Yeah, I spent most of my life in the OSF. I can't do much other than fight. How is someone like that supposed to live outside the military? I'm ashamed to say that I'm afraid of that day coming. If I have to live on carrying these feelings for my fallen comrades, then I think I'd rather die in battle. I'm sorry. That was a stupid thing to say. I don't understand. If you're serious about wanting to die, then I misjudged you. You say that you're the only one left alive, but it's not like you've survived this long on your own. Even my sister was worried about your health. And you just roll over and die? That's so selfish. I don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. I'm leaving. Goodbye. <sighs> what is he thinking? Naomi was so concerned about him. It's not like I haven't thought about giving up my own life, if it could help save her. But that would only make her sad. I thought he would have figured that out. Alright. Alright, let's start with the gifts for everyone. The rain model? Okay, that's odd. Yeah, I guess, okay. Thank you. Sorry, we were just trying to think of when we were... We were just looking at most of the gifts that we are trying to give well, to I these was, people. Let's just say we were thinking of when, uh, if we are going to keep going or not with this video. To 
Thank you. Oh yeah, oh, a picture of lightning. I completely forgot how much he. Yeah, he loves him. lightning. Of course, her painting your scroll will represent speed. Taste. Boy, you really are capable, Kasane. I'm detecting some sarcasm. If I was being sarcastic, I'd say it sarcastically. I have a pretty good eye for people. Just accept the compliment. You really are getting along well with the guys in this platoon. My hat's off to you. Hey, level three. Sustained. Oh yeah, and now I can attack while invisible, which is useful. Oh, we got a teddy bear as a present from Kagura. Hey, team bond level three. Obtained force field look mark. Yeah, that's useful. It's not like I have I think you'll six. find that I can warm your frosty heart. There's no need for that. At least I know now that you're actually considerate. Right, and Kyoka. Wait, I already did Kyoka. That was the little brain thing. All right then, let's, let's save here. Say, yeah, let's save So we're going to have to cut it here for today. My name is Kay. And I'm Z. And we'll see you next time in Scarlet. Next. Peace out, guys.